In this video, I'm going to show you how to configure a switch so it will prompt for the user to enter the username and password through the console port. In other words, if someone want to come through the console port on the switch, then they have to enter the username and the password. Also, I will configure so that if someone tell net to the switch, it will prompt for the admin password. The default login username is admin. Okay, so it will prompt for the admin user password. Let's see how that works. Now, the PC is already have an IP address already. Okay, right here. Also, the switches, it's already has this IP address. Show, run. Let's look at it. Those are the requirements. We have to have the IP address on the PC and also on the switches. Already done that. Now the first thing that we need to do, we need to type the username. Username, this is something that you can choose whatever you want to use. Those that are between the code, okay? Between these quotations right here. This is username is a command. And then privilege is a command. And secret is a command. But those are in the quotation or those that you can type whatever you want. So in this case, comp t username, and then the username, I'm going to call it Tang. Then type the word privilege, and then the level is 15, and the word secret, and then the password. I'm just call it CTI120 console. Press enter. Okay. So I'm done with these steps right here. The next step is to type in the line con zero local login local. So I need to get to the interface right here, the or the console port. How do I that do that to get into that console port? I simply type interface con zero. Okay, let me see what's wrong in here. Oh, we have to do comp t first. Okay, it's already there. Not interface, but should be line. Comp zero. Okay, press enter. Now we are inside of that. Then we simply type the word login local. Login local. Okay, I'm done with that one. And let's look at the do show run. I notice that the username that I just created is username Tang, and the password is encrypted because I use the word secret instead of password. Okay, now the console port is now have the statement on this uh, line local right here, login local. So let's test that out. Control Z to get to the privilege mode. Exit. Press enter. There you go. Now it prompts for me to type in the username. Tang. And the password. CTI120 console. Enter. There you go. So I am in the switch now. Now the next thing that I want to do, I want to configure so we can tell net to that switches. Okay. Tell net is also another powerful command. All right. So let's test it out. Telnet 192.168.2.5, I believe. That's the IP address. And it's not allow me to Telnet 2 because we have not configured it yet. Make sure that the show run IP address is correct. Yep, it is correct. Okay. So what we need to do, we need to configure the VTY session to do that. Comp T get to the configuration mode. Then type line VTY. Right now the VTY happen to have a total of 16 sessions. Start with zero all the way to 15. So I want to go ahead and configure all of them. Okay. Some of the switch might only have zero to five. If that's the case, you only need to configure the session zero to five. So 0 through 15, and what we need to do, we need to type the password, and then the password in here itself. This is the 
between the quotation, meaning you can use anything. So password, and I'm just call it CTI120, no quotation, CTI120VTY. Press enter. Then after that, I need to type in the privilege and the level X, which is 1 through 15. We're going to use 15. So privilege level 1, 5. Enter. Okay, I'm done with that. Let's see it. the telnet is going to work now. Up arrow key, telnet again. Here you go. Prompt for the password CTI120VTY. Now this password right here is belong to the admin now. It's admin password. It is not the same password like the username tag a little while ago. So right now there are two usernames in these switches. Okay? And they are the two usernames. One is Tang and the other one, the default one is admin. Okay? Alright, that's all. Thank you.